Rust. This story is probably unlike anything you have seen from your favourite Rust creators before. This story has all the struggles of solo Rust, all in one video, but it also shows you can still have a good time, even when you die. Now, by no means am I a Chad, and you'll see that in this video. So if you're looking for some insane PvP content, go watch Posty, because this video is not where it's at. I've tried to make this video as chill and as smooth flowing as possible. So uh, I hope you enjoy. Let's get into it. So in this video, I attempt to make a cool underground bunker. Or should I say underwater bunker? Now I came up with this um, in a little build server. So if you really want to see it uh, in a build video, then uh, maybe I can do that for you. Just let me know in the comments. Tier one. I'll take that, thank you, and some metal. I managed to find this perfect location for my build, but it was getting to night time. So I thought I'd make a little platform and wait it out till the morning. Unfortunately, waiting out till morning made me die to this lucky guy with his spear gun. So it was back to the drawing board. After finally managed to get a level 2 by one base up, whilst waiting around, unfortunately we had a guy roll up. Now when you only got a one wooden door, it's very easily readable. And unfortunately I lost the fight. But that's just the way Rust goes. Again, back to the door. So, third time lucky, we managed to get a metal door down and upgrade the rest of our base. Hopefully, we wouldn't get raided again. Is your inventory severely lacking Rust skins? If you use my code LEFTYP in all caps on Rust Clash, you can receive cases that can be claimed every single day. You can also claim rakeback when you use my code. Rust Clash now offer a dynamic referral code, which means you can change it every 24 hours. Rust Clash has loads of different deposit methods, including Rust, CSGO, and Dota 2 skins, and they even have a crypto option. Rust Clash has all your favourite game modes, including my favourite, the Roulette Wheel. Rust Clash gives away over $25,000 a week using the Rain feature, which you can easily enter to through chat. So make sure you use my code LEFTYP in all capitals and get yourself some free skins. Also, make sure you gamble responsibly. Once I got my base up, I looked around for a boat, finally found one not too far from my base. So I took it out to do a bit of farming on the ocean. After farming for a while on the ocean, I managed to head to the recycler at the fishing village on Wilgem servers, recycle my stuff and then head home. Nice, we actually came back with quite a bit then. Should be enough to get us going for this wipe. Upgrade this for you. Lovely. After a little bit of farming and uh, making myself a revolver, I went out to try and find some people to kill. Not too sure how much this guy has, but he's found the barrel, so... Not too much. I'll take it though. It's free stuff. After depoting this little bit of stuff, I wanted to take the boat out to Oregon, as I'd just seen it been taken and I wanted to pick up the scraps. After finding a nice little bit of stuff on oil rig, like a python and a helmet, I heard someone jump on, so I went to go check it out. Now this is the first encounter 
where you'll see that I am horrible at this game. Uh, I'm gonna push him here. Uh, <laughs> Damn, I'm, I'm real good at this game. You win some, you lose some, I guess. After that death, I did a bit more boat farming and then decided I wanted to hit some wood. So that's exactly what I did. I didn't think that I would come across this guy here. Oh no. I hope this guy hasn't seen me. I've only got a crossbow. I don't really know what I can do here. Okay, that is uh, that is how my pipe's going. Damn. Well, I'll be able to catch this guy actually. Oh yeah, he's coming this way on a horse. Oh. Oh. Oh, blue card. Thank you. I'll take that. It's gonna be the start of my wipe. After depot and all of this loot, I had a little commotion breaking out outside my base, so I went to go check it out with my revolver. Just heard a guy down here, I think he might be door camping him. Oh, yep. Okay, come on. Can't catch a break, man. After seeing where that guy ran, I decided to go door camping myself. But, unfortunately, he had nothing good for me. Well, uh, a little bit of stuff. Not really worth it, really. After this, it became night time, so I decided to grab all of my stuff, wait for day, and go and start building my underground bunker base. Now, my area was pretty hot with shots, so I needed to be quick with this. That's perfect. Go on, place. Um, right, the doorway is going to be here. I need more stability. Great. Right, let's at least get this TC down. Nice. Finally, finally got a TC down. I can now go ahead and demolish all these bits that I don't need. Nice. What the fuck though? Um, we're gonna need... Uh, I'll sort that bit out in a minute. Get up here. Right, so we're gonna go doorway here and here. These will be for vending machines. And then frames all around like that. Get this upgraded. Stone. Okay, this is going to be a problem, I think. Oh, there we go. Right, and then we can... Triangles all on here. 
this all upgraded and then we can put a door on the front Let's make that a double door and cover it in with walls nice uh, I'm gonna want this one wood and then the rest can be stone Buzzing. Oh, we got a boat pulling up. Yes, bro. I love oh, the base. Oh, man. Yes. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> you get some funny characters on this game. On my way back to base to try and get some more loot to transfer, I was getting roof camp from my now new neighbor, which is always a great sign when you move into a new area. After sorting all my loot out, placing some boxes, I heard a guy jump outside on my boat and I assumed I was getting door camped. So I went out with just a crossbow and tried to kill him. But obviously he had better guns than me. After that I made a last trip to my base to grab everything I could so I could transfer it to the new one. And lucky for me it was a success. After getting slapped around a load, I thought I'd make myself a saw with some ammo and some meds and go and check out to see if I can find a green card at the nearest monument. Unfortunately, there was no green card there, so I took my boat and headed back to oil as it just recently got done again. I thought I'd give it a second try. But there really wasn't much there, so I jumped off and headed back to base. On my way back to base, I noticed the cargo was coming out, so I thought, fuck it, why not give it a shot? I'm hoping nobody's got on this yet. It's literally just been called in. Well, not called in, but it's literally just spawned in. Come on, yes. Right, it's been a since I've done cargo, so I'm hoping. No, I'm not. Gonna get it. Uh, well, I'm hoping I can manage to get it done and uh, make this wipe a little bit better. Ooh, Tommy! So no scientist down here. I'll take that. Never mean someone's down here, or not here for some reason. Can't even see him. Okay, now I can see him. <laughs> I'm probably gonna die here, aren't I? Okay, I think they've just like, spawned in. Yeah. Oh, and there's. After that death on cargo, I decided to boat down to the snow to try and get some resources. And I managed to find this guy. For some reason, he was really, really low. But to my surprise, he, uh, he knew who I was. Oh my god, Lefty P! I love you, man! I love you so much, bro! <laughs> Big fan, bro! <laughs> <laughs> no way, man. Thank you, I appreciate it. I can't believe it, man. I'm, I'm <laughs> actually built... Oh, he died. Well, if you're watching this, bro, four weeks later, I finally decided to edit it. Uh, thank you for watching the videos. I appreciate it. Now, finally, with enough resources, I decided to upgrade my pace a little bit. And that started by destroying this. 
Right, let's uh, just do a little bit of honeycomb, I think. On the on the top level to this base. So we're not just a 2C4 raid straight away. If I can manage to get up here. Slap a nice little ladder hatch here. And uh Oh, I need to make a drop down, don't I? Um Oh shit, that's the wrong one. This to be this one. That was a waste. Why can't I place that? Hmm. I think I'm going to um, get my electric furnaces down somehow. Not quite sure how I'm going to get to the third level yet. But we'll figure it out. There we go. Yeah, wool there. Wrap round. Um. Actually no, we'll just have a we'll have a jump up here, why not? Then that could be storage. It's not full down there. Right, storage here. place our um what do you call it solar panel solar panel just up here for now yeah that should work right the way there place that north and connect it up
After waiting for daytime to roll around, I thought I'd go out and do a little bit of farming with a saw. As soon as I had enough metal, I went down to the bottom of my base to make myself my garage. Now this garage didn't end up working, it was meant to be for submarines, uh, but I realised after making it that they don't fit. So I've now got a spare garage. After doing the final upgrades to my base, I decided it was time for me to log off for the night in hopes that I wouldn't be raided in the morning. And to my surprise, I wasn't. Nice, we're not raided. Furnace is still going. Awesome. Let's hope today is not as bad as yesterday. Oh boy, was I wrong. Now, I started off the day by buying myself a submarine to see if it fit in my base, which we all know that it didn't. I decided hola, to go and hola, get a red estás? card from this guy hola, up hola, here. Como estás? Hey, what's up, man? Yo, here to buy from shop. Yeah, man, I'm here to get a red. Okay, okay, I see, I see. Okay, there's a good Bro, there. come, come, shop, bro, come, come. Where are you, bro? Just out the front, man. Oh, Lefty P, bro, is it you? <laughs> oh, how's it going, man? Hello, bro. How's it going, bro? Bro, that one, that one video, bro. Um, farmer boss, that was me, mate. The the double. Oh, I got. I've got the POV of that, you know. Yeah, yeah. Damn, bro. <laughs> Damn, man. Um, but did I hear a python just shoot at you there? By the way. Yeah, man. He was just on the hill. Oh right. Well, I've just counted the kid on rig, mate. He's looking for me, man. He's looking for me, bro. <laughs> yeah. Well. Uh, good luck, man. Oh. Uh, yeah, yeah. No bother, mate. Say you later. Oh, he was a nice guy. He was uh, the guy that killed me in, in one of my last videos. That's always great. After that run, I decided to take my green and blue card down to airfield uh, to see if we could get lucky with the crates. And hopefully nobody had done it. Until we found this guy. Damn, that was some bad shooting by me. Oh, GG's. GG's, bro. GG's, sir. You just, Holy sh you just got me in a uh, tunnel run. Swim this home. My bad, dude. Yeah. Oh, he died. Um, what, what can I take? Uh, don't need bandages. Right, let's go. Stop getting greedy. Hopefully I can make this home. I think I might stop off at Fish and Village for cycle. Shit. Damn man, that's a lot. Damn, we made it. Nice. That's a lot, bro. After that insane amount of luck, I decided to push my luck once more and go try ring. Okay, I just heard a guy. Um, just hoping the scientists don't come down and get me. Oh, there he is. Now I really, really hate fighting. Yeah, I don't know why, I'm just really bad at fighting scientists. I'm not good at it at all. Just 
Just like that. Oh, what is going on? Oh, of course there's a mini coming. Oh, great. Um... Yeah, I don't know, it's just like jumping off here. To do here. Right, let's get on this boat and let's go. I hope this guy doesn't see me. I mean, he's obviously going to see me, but I hope he hasn't got a bow here or something. He probably does, let's be real. Yeah, of course he does. Uh, yeah, right, there's no point. I'm dead here. Sweet. I decided to do a tunnels run after this, but again, ultimately ended up dying. And that is exactly where I called it for this wipe. Now, not every wipe goes the best. Not every wipe does how you want. Um, this video is basically just me showing you how bad I am at the game, really. Um, but I thought, why not waste the content? I spent quite a few hours, you know, making it. So, uh... I might as well put it out for you guys. I also did a poll and you guys seem to want it. So, why not? I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, let me know what builds you want to see in the future. And uh, what sort of gameplay you want to see. Peace, and I'll see you in the next one.